El tiempo presente en español. Present tense in Spanish. Explicación gramatical de los verbos regulares terminados en AR. Our goals in Spanish. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to 1. Demonstrate comprehension about the conjugation of the regular verbs ending in AR. 2. Identify the stem of the regular verbs ending in AR and their corresponding endings with every personal pronoun for the correct conjugation in present tense. Nuestros objetivos en español. Al final de esta lección, tú podrás 1. Demostrar comprensión acerca de la conjugación de los verbos regulares terminados en AR. 2. Identificar las raíces de los verbos regulares terminados en AR y sus correspondientes terminaciones de cada pronombre personal para una correcta conjugación en tiempo presente. Los pronombres personales. Personal pronouns. Personal pronouns in Spanish. Yo, tú, él, ella, usted, nosotros, nosotras, vosotros, vosotras, ellos, ellas, ustedes. The simple present tense. This is the most common tense in English and Spanish. And it is also known as indicative because it can be used to ask questions and make statements. Remember, the present tense has a very easy pattern to follow with regular verbs ending in AR, ER, and IR. All personal pronouns keep the same stem but different verb endings. El presente simple. Este es el tipo gramatical más común en inglés y en español. Y también se le conoce como el indicativo, ya que se puede usar para hacer preguntas y para hacer declaraciones o enunciados. Recuerde que el tiempo presente tiene un mismo formato a seguir con los verbos regulares terminados en ar, er o ir. Todos los pronombres personales conservan la misma raíz, pero tienen diferentes terminaciones verbales. Spanish verb conjugation, regular verbs. There are three different groups or categories of verbs in Spanish. These groups are determined by the ending of the last two letters of the verb in infinitive. AR verbs like a amar, to love, e are verbs like beber, to drink, and I are verbs like vivir, to live. Remember that the infinitive is the basic form of the verb, to work, trabajar, to sleep, dormir, to run, correr, to fly, volar, All infinitive verbs in Spanish end in ar, er, or ir. Conjugación de los verbos regulares terminados en ar. Verb conjugation, regular verbs ending in ar. When we talk about conjugation of a verb, means to manipulate the infinitive so that it agrees with all different personal pronouns. In English, we can conjugate a verb like this. To cook, cocinar. I cook, yo cocino. You cook, tú cocinas. He cooks, él cocina. She cooks, ella cocina. We cook, 
nosotros o nosotras cocinamos. You cook, vosotros o vosotras cocináis. You all cook, ustedes cocinan. They cook, ellos, ellas cocinan. The present tense in Spanish has three different meanings. The Spanish sentence, yo cocino, could mean, yo cocino, I cook, yo cocino, I am cooking, yo cocino, I do cook. AR, regular verbs in Spanish have two parts. One, the stem of the verb to the AR ending. A stem is everything that is left after we drop the AR ending. Ending is the last two letters of the regular verb. In this case, we have AR. Stems. Amar. To love. The stem is AM. Bailar. To dance. The stem is BAIL. Caminar, to walk. The stem is C-A-M-I-N. Cantar, to sing. The stem would be C-A-N-T. Comprar, to buy. The stem is C-O-M-P-R. Entrar, to enter. The stem would be E-N-T-R. And escuchar, to listen to. The stem would be E-S-C-U-C-H. In this lesson, we are going to use the verb amar, to love, as a model. It is important to remember that the stem of the verb is going to be exactly the same one for all the personal pronouns. For example, amar, to love, we need to drop A-R, and the left of the verb, in this case, am, is the stem. Let's conjugate the verb amar by just changing the endings. Remember, amar, am, is going to be the stem. One, I love, yo amo. All is the ending for yo, yo amo. Two, you love. Tú amas. AS is the ending for tú. Tú amas. Three. He or she loves. Él, ella ama. A is the ending for él, ella. Él o ella ama. Four. We love. Nosotros o nosotras amamos. Amos is the ending for nosotros and nosotras. Nosotros, nosotras amamos. Five, you love. Vosotros, vosotras amáis. Ais is the ending for vosotros and vosotras. Vosotros o vosotras amáis. Six, you love. Ustedes aman. A N is the ending for ustedes. Ustedes aman. 7. They love. Ellos, ellas aman. A-N is the ending for ellos, ellas. Ellos, ellas aman. Remember, this is very easy. In order to conjugate regular verbs in Spanish ending in AR, you just need to drop AR and add the following endings for different personal pronouns. Yo amo, tú amas, él, ella, usted ama, nosotros, nosotras amamos, vosotros, vosotras amáis, ellos, ellas, ustedes aman. El tiempo presente en español. Present tense in Spanish.